Philadelphia, Travis Konechny scored his second goal 127 into overtime when the Philadelphia Flyers defeated Detroit Red Wings, 6-5 at Wells Fargo Center on Saturday, after blowing a four-goal lead in the third period. Konechny got his rebound, wrapped around behind the Detroit net, and tucked the puck inside the post to the right of goalie Jonathan Bernier. Watch all Red Wings at Flyers highlights, it feels good to get that one, especially when you have the thought of maybe losing a game that you shouldn't have, Konechny said. Credit to the Red Wings that they didn't give up, but we're just glad we came out on top with this. Nolan Patrick had a goal and two assists for Philadelphia, 2 7, 2 4, 7, which is the 1st of January 11 in its past 13 games. Scott Lawton and Shane Gostas each had a goal and an assist, and Jakub Borchuk scored. Carter Hart made 33 saves. Anthony Mantha scored twice in the third period for the Red Wings, 2-3, 2-8-8, and Bernier made seven saves after relieving Jimmy Howard, five goals on 24 shots, video, that at fight, Mantha ties the game with seven seconds left, we decided to play 18 minutes and we got four goals, Mantha said. We've got good talent in here. I think if we played the right way we could win games, Bernier replaced Howard after the Flyers took a 5-2-1 lead on Patrick's goal at 124 of the third. Tyler Bertuzzi, who returned after missing seven games with an upper body injury, scored from the slot to make it 5-2 at 2.39, and Thomas Vanek finished an end-to-end -end rush 44 seconds later with a goal from the left circle at 3.23. To make it 5-3, Mantha scored his first goal in 10 games when he tipped a Danny DeKaiser shot past Hart at 8.36 to make it 5-4, and then tipped a Mike Green shot past Hart with seven seconds remaining. Mantha said the goalie change provided a spark, goalie switch always wakes us up, he said. It tells us that we're playing terrible. Between the guys, we knew we had to play way better than what we did in the first two periods, the victory put the Flyers six points behind the Pittsburgh Penguins for the second wild card into the Stanley Cup playoffs from the Eastern Conference, we got two points, Voracek said. Doesn't matter how we get them. Should have wrapped it up earlier to save some energy but for us it's important we got those two points. Gostas Fair scored from the left side at 4.34 of the first period to give the Flyers a 1-0 lead. Video, dead at fight, Gostas Fair beats Howard to open scoring Gustav Nyquist to the Bertuzzi pass past hard to make it 1-1 at 14.07, Konechny put the Flyers ahead 2-1 with a power play goal at 2.59 of the second period, and Lawton made it 3-1 at 4-2. The goal ended Lawton's 26-game drought dating to deck. 15, Voracek scored 31 seconds into the third to make it 4-1, but Flyers coach Scott Gordon said his team stopped playing smart, I think we sat back a little bit, he said. Just from in on the Voracek putting pace, we made a lot of soft plays, particularly coming out of our zone rather than making plays with certainty. They were able to pick some things off at the blue line. Credit to them, they didn't lay down and die just because it was 5-2-1. I think that's a lot more controllable than just giving them credit but we can do a better job too, they said it. After 40 minutes, we talked in here, we weren't happy with how we played. I don't think we played with a lot of passion, a lot of energy. It's unfortunate for some reason why we didn't have that passion the first 40 minutes, but obviously it's great to get a point. Red Wings forward Thomas Van Eck, you definitely want to cheat a little bit, but trying to do the same things I've been doing since the start of the year. Just being a reliable guy and going out there and creating things in the offensive zone. Nice to get that one, Flyers forward Scott Lawton, on ending a 26-game goal drought video, dead at fight, Lawton caps the rush to double the lead need to know Red Wings forward Dylan Larkin played in his 300th NHL game. Flyers goalie Cam Talbot, acquired in a trade with the Edmonton Oilers on Friday for goalie Anthony Stolarz, will not be with the team in Detroit on Sunday. Gordon would not commit to a starting goalie. Konechny's goal gave the Flyers power play goals in four straight games for the first time since January 4, 13, 2018. Voracek has 11 points, 4 goals, 7 assists during a 9-game point streak.
dot dot dot. The Flyers sent forward Mikhail Vorobov to Lehigh Valley of the American Hockey League. What's next? Red Wings host the Philadelphia Flyers on Sunday, 6 p.m. ET, NBCSN, NHL, TV, Flyers, at the Detroit Red Wings on Sunday, 6 p.m. ET, NBCSN, NHL, TV, Video, Konechny's OT winner lifts Flyers by Red Wings.